What's up everybody? This is Sigas. I wake up early in the morning urging some damn chicken. So I decide I'm gonna go to KFC because that's the only chicken place in my area. I walk inside and everybody stops. People taking orders stop. The females with the damn menu stop. They just stop and stare at my ass like I was a National Geographic mother. They just look at me like I'm a damn lion eating a gazelle. One fat white man with like five carts of mashed potatoes had a big ass spoonful of mashed potatoes and was dripping down onto his nasty ass lap, staring at me. Look like a fat ass John Goodman. The white girl at the counter, sexy as hell. The white girl looked like Paris Hilton before the whole cocaine charge and everything. I go inside KFC, the white girl look at me and say, Hello sir, would you like some of our delicious chicken? No, I'm in here to lick one of your of course I want some damn delicious chicken. Why else would I be inside a KFC? So I said, look, dumbass white girl, I don't got time for your games. I want a 10 piece. She gonna look at me and say, okay, sir, that'll be $15. Are you out of your damn mind? $15 for some damn chicken? $15. Do you know how much 15 is? That's one and a five. Does it look like I got $15? I'm wearing the same shirt I wore in every other single angry black man. Does it look like I have $15 just laying around in my booty pipe? So I just asked the hey, you want me to give your boyfriend a or something so you could give me the $15? $15? This ain't tickets to a Glee concert. This is an evil class organization. Do you know the walls inside KFC was built by the skulls of all African slaves? They got skull wallpaper inside of KFCs. And if you don't believe me, Knock on one of the walls and then put your ear to it. You will hear an African tribe singing the new Dari Mitush song. I'm sorry, America, if you think I hate Colonel Sanders, aka Colonel, I hate but it's true, the dude hates black people. You wanna know why? Because he did not make the recipe for KFC. He have you all tricked. He would have you all believe that he was the one that was slaving over that hot ass stove. No, he wasn't. That mother had slaves. It was not inside of the cooking that damn chicken and every time they got the recipe wrong he'll bust them inside of the face with a hammer after he had the slaves make the good ass chicken he invited a whole bunch of his white friends over so they could beat the shit out of the slaves that just cooked the chicken while they was beating the shit out of Kim Buju, they decided to take a bite out of the chicken the rest is history and everyone always wondering why they got the buckets for KFC chicken why is it inside of buckets I'll tell you why it goes back to the slavery days yeah, it did. After the slaves cooked the chicken, Colonel Sanders had their heads cut off and put inside of a bucket. You know what KFC stands for? Killing As soon as I walked in there, guys, y'all think I'm lying. As soon as I walked inside of there, there was a big ass kitchen with grease in it. And the dude was about to put the chicken inside of the grease. He just threw a piece of chicken over the damn counter. And because I'm a I caught the chicken in my mouth. Look at Colonel, I hate Look at him! Smiling at you because you eat his chicken laced with the blood of Africans across the country. I smell the chicken cooking. You, you see how they playing with me? Oh, let's heat up the chicken a lot in this microwave so that big fat black <laughs> outside can smell the chicken and walk inside and pay the $15. That ain't gonna work, bitch. The mashed potatoes taste like they got athlete's foot inside of it or something. They got the nastiest mashed potato. That's like a dude that's got his balls and dipped it inside of the damn mashed potatoes. The rice smells and tastes like they had it inside of an Asian boy's booty hole for four years. Now don't ask me how I know what an Asian boy's booty hole smelled like. I was in jail. It was a traumatic experience. KFC some nasty ass bad. You know what I saw one KFC worker do today? This dude ordered some chicken and got an attitude with him. So he got his finger stuffed it in his ass and then dipped his hand in the gravy. <laughs> this ain't no joke. Did you know KFC's gravy is not really gravy, it's Indian's blood? You must not know who I is. I'm the angry black man, and I'm angry. Fix it, KFC. Fix it.